Hello and welcome back everyone, I'm James Rose and it's raiding time in Valhalla. You know though, a raid is an important thing and we don't want to mess it up, so we need to make sure we're prepared. First off, I think what we want to do is go to our skills, because we have a few more points. And... Did I accidentally select this at some point? No, I can select it, cool. Cool, we can do stealth damage now, so I'm going to take that. And then, I've actually mostly taken that so I can take this. Because Way of the Raven gives us a bonus to the gear we're currently wearing. I also want to then take this. Melee damage is good. More importantly, I want to see what happens to this uh, cloud over here. There we go. Yeah, look at this. And then there's even more shoots that go off elsewhere. This is good. I like this. Ooh, more bonuses to Raven gear. Cool, so we have one skill point left. What can we spend it on? Stealth damage, I don't think it's going to help here. Light damage might be helpful. Way of the Wolf won't help. Or ability damage, we don't have any abilities. So I think in this case, probably light damage is our best bet. Because I do use light attacks a lot. What we may also be able to do is upgrade some of our gear. I want to see if I can do that from here. I can. Oh no, that wasn't... That wasn't the same kind of upgrade as when you actually take it to a guy, though, was it? Also, do I have a rune I can put in this? I don't. Is, um, is the blacksmith guy open right now? I don't think he is. I think I just need to get in the boat. Caught anything? Not today. The fish aren't biting. Too many passing boats churning the water. Oh, don't worry. I'm going to go and catch us lots of stuff from uh, our rival Shooting settlement. Fish with a bow. That could work. It does sound like there's going to be a fishing minigame later, though, which I fully approve of. Uh, in Final Fantasy XV, the best minigame is quite clearly the fishing one, and I will fight anyone who disagrees. Uh, anyway, you're the one I actually wanted to speak to. Can you upgrade anything Welcome I've got? Back, Wolf so, this. Yes. So, that upgrade we did did make it better. However, this upgrade he can do is different. Um, I do need something I don't have to do those upgrades, though. So, I can't do anything there, unfortunately. But we can upgrade the equipment we have. Five. That's what those little bars Come are for I wasn't sure about before. Those are the smaller upgrades you can do. So this has four bars. I don't have enough materials to upgrade it. Anything? No, it looks like it's all greyed out. I can't actually upgrade anything right now. Okay, we're as strong as we're going to get. So I guess now we need to go and do a raid. Uh, I believe all the boys are already in the longship. We've got um, these two people that are arguably more important than us following us along. Because we are main characters, so they need to follow us. Where can I get a great sword like Sigurd's? I want that. Alright boys, get in the boat. It's raiding time. Oh, I'm on the wrong end of the boat. To the waves. Come on. Push. Go. Oh, I thought you were actually going to... Um... I can't put... Can I put my sail up? Can't break. Sail out. Sea there Warriors. we go. Dringy. When I was away, far from these frozen shores, wondering if I should ever see home again, I grew afraid. Afraid I would not return in time to see Kurtwes and... Afraid... I would not see him bleed out like a stuck pig in a drift of snow. But here I am, home in time to join those I have missed, those I love, in this glorious fight. Today we seize Nochtfall from Kurtwe. Tonight his... Oh, that's not, sorry, that's not what I wanted. I wanted a cinematic camera. I guess I can't cinematic camera right now. It will burst from fear. He will beseech the gods for aid. For they will be deaf to his cries. And soon, 
The Raven Clan will feast on his death. Oh, we're cannibals. That's what we're here. That's why we're called Ravens. Lead us to victory. I will show the way, but you must lead us there. Oh, Hayward. I missed having you at my side. How I wish I could have taken you along on my travels. Steve Young did not trust fate with both our lives. You have no reason to fear. Together, we are unstoppable. Yes, we need to take all of the wealth from this settlement. Can I go into... How do I get cinematic camera? So it, I know it's one of the thingy buttons, but it's not working. Maybe I can't do cinematic camera with the sail up? That seems silly, though. Oh, one thing to mention. Um, previously, with regards to the graphics, I had everything apart from the environmental detail maxed out. Um, I have now also maxed out the environmental detail because I didn't. The my computer didn't seem to be struggling at all. The environmental detail was quite taxing um, with regards to resources, so I had left that one down. Anyway, raiding time. Come on then, mate. There we go, next. Oh, I got hit by an arrow. Oh, that exploded. Okay. That I was not ready for. How do I roll? There we go. Um, I assumed roll would work, because that's how it worked in Odyssey with fire. Why am I on fire again? I wish I had more than one ration. There's a lot of pots that can be lit up on fire here by the looks of it. And it looks like it's probably best if I just shoot them all in advance of actually getting to them. That way they're not going to explode while I'm next to them. Oh hello. Stay quick me. Almost there. Thank you. Don't suffer. Ooh, I need to be more careful. I'm taking a lot less damage now, I'm actually wearing armor though. Oh, I'm out of arrows, that's no good. Can I take arrows off of some of these guys? I got one I got one arrow back. Some wealth over this way apparently. Oh I bet it's in there. Stop setting me on fire. It needs to be more obvious where I get set on fire if I go. Can I loot here? You loot in there? No? That's a loot with some arrows, that'll be helpful. Well, that won't be difficult. <laughs> ah, I wasn't expecting that to actually be an ability. Okay, so the wealth things can be new abilities. Interesting. Can I get out of here? I'm supposed to go find Sigurd anyway. Is there anything else here I should be picking up while I'm about? I don't think there's anything else important. What I do think is I should use my ration and then not actually have any berries here. Okay. Well, I'm in a blooming settlement. Why can't I find food?
I mean, maybe it's all on fire. That is a possibility. Oh, the green team has shown up. Hail Raventlan! You reap a bloody harvest. Who are you, Gester? Name yourself. I know his face. He met with your father not long ago. I did, indeed. I am Guthorm, uncle to King Harold of the North. I speak for my nephew when there is need. This is not King Harold's land. Why does he send warriors so far south? You may ask him yourself, my lord. Thank you, uncle. And you are Sigurd of the Raven Clan, is that right? Son of the wise King Stebjorn. I am. And you are standing on his land, King Harold. Land we have reclaimed with blood and steel. That I see, and I honor it. For I have not come to war against you, but for you, at the request of your father. The canny wolf. Was this the plan he spoke of? I offer my support. With my warriors, your Raven clan can take Kjotve's fortress and settle this rivalry for good. This is good news, Eivor. The wandering king will tip our fortunes. Yeah, what do you get? Why risk your men to help us, king? Have you a stake in this fight? This war between Ketwe's clan and your own has long simmered on my southern border. I wish to see it put to rest. There would be no peace while Ketwe lives. But there is much agreement between your father and me. This blood feud runs deep, King Harold. We welcome your help, but I must lead the charge. I see. Is this a question of honor? It is. Many winters ago, Ketwe broke an oath to our fathers. He betrayed a friendly peace and slaughtered many. I understand. Sigurd Jarl will lead the assault against Kjotve and his clan. Give him full command of my ships and my warriors. When your victory is in hand, Sigurd, find me at Alrekstadir, and we will celebrate together. I feel like we're going to get betrayed at the end. At Florley, near the mouth of the fjord northeast of here. Will you join us? Hold a moment. You captain our longship, Eivor. Meet us there, and we will claim Kjotve's head for the gods. Brother, I have waited too many years for this day. When Kjotve stands before us, give me the final blow. You will have it, Eivor. You deserve it. Eivor, give us a hand. Ardald is generous with his troops. More than I would be. I cannot fathom his game. He's either a young fool, or deceptively wise. Whatever his reason, I have a good feeling this war is near its end. I'm sure, considering we end up having to go to England, this will end well. Having knowledge of the future makes predicting these things a little bit easier. Cool, now, is there anything nearby I want to pick up? I'd like some rations again. I'm yet to figure out the best way to pick up rations. If I'm going to run around for a few minutes, though, I guess that'll do. Let's see, where are we? We're in a completely different area now, okay. There is a sink point up there. I'm kind of tempted just to go straight to the mission, though. I think we'll do that. Although, if I can get a ration in the meantime, that'd be great. You got a ration? Oh, he had some rations. I have a ration again now, I think. So have we already won the fort? Is this the fort we took, or is this just a staging area? Now, we do have some more skills. Oh, I also have... Abilities are learned through books of knowledge. Okay, so we can only get them through getting those books. They are powerful fighting moves that can be used during battle at the cost of adrenaline. So like in other Assassin's games. 
Some abilities focus on melee, while others provide ranged abilities. Up to eight can be assigned at once. Apparently throwing axes is a melee ability. Uh, when you find a second book of knowledge with the same ability, that ability is drastically improved. To find more books, explore the world and search for wealth in each territory. Books are often heavily guarded in monasteries or military camps. Okay, so if we actually want to get better abilities, we need to um, be a completionist and loot things. Then what do we want to do with our skills? Backstab is actually, I think, a very good skill to pick up, which I can't because I'm too away from it. There we go. And then we'll get that. Now we do increased defense damage and stagger enemies when hitting them from behind, which I think will be quite helpful. I climb up in here, yes. Eivor, you missed the opening act. Kurtve's forward camp melted like a spring thaw at our approach. Is it from here we launch our attack? We do indeed, and we are ready to fight. King Harold's forces are well in place. Only give the word. I will, but before we strike, I have a request. Name it. That Eivor may give challenge to Kurtve at the gate of his fortress. A battle to the death in single combat. Is... is this what you want? Kyotve robbed my father of all honor and dignity. I will win it back. When honor is at stake, let none interfere. And if Kyotve should die before the battle begins, all the better for our chances. I can't see him agreeing to that. Uh, yeah, let's go. Today my blade must do the work of Skuld's sharp scissors and cut short the cord of Kjotve's fate. Well said, my sharp-tongued warrior scout. May we all live to hear that saga sung. Eivor, a word. Basim, Hytham. This feud is not yours, yet you fight it all the same. I find that strange. You find it strange because you are wrong. Our clan, the Hidden Ones, have been fighting with Kyotve's order for centuries. You came from Miklagard to kill Kyotve yourself? We did. Or rather, we came so that Hytham could kill him. My apprentice has been studying this target for many months. Nope, he's mine. Kyotve's You're not getting anywhere near him. So great outside Norway? Not his reputation alone. But the order to which he belongs. Something of a rival clan to our own. Hytham, I mean no disrespect to you or the Hidden Ones. But Kyotve is mine. My family's honor is at stake. I understand. All that matters is that Kyotve dies this day. On that, we are agreed. Good. He's not going to try and steal my prey. to watch me feed your innards to my raven. Look at this! <laughs> Once again, Abel Wolfkist appears to take a swipe at me. This... This is my father's shame. Today I take back the honor he lost. I call a home gang! Here! Against the Oathbreaker! I will make you beg as your father begged, Wolfkist. <laughs> Squeal as your mother squealed. He thinks he doesn't even need a weapon against us. What a chance. I have new respect I for him. Yours. You are 
Oh, that didn't go well. It's alright, I dodged that second one. Okay, I want to try this. Oh, that could have done more damage. But I get the impression that uh, it's hard to do a lot of damage to him. Oh, but he can do a lot of damage to us. Okay, his moveset is simple. I just have to be careful. And I do have a heal. Oh, damn it. I did so much damage. Oh, no. I'm that one wrong. The heal doesn't even do a full heal on us. Okay, we're halfway through. Hopefully I can block these attacks. No, apparently I can't. I need to be careful not to use up all my stamina at any one point as well. Oh, he could just block arrows with axes. What is this man? I could have could have blocked that. I need to try and block them. Yeah. So. Oh, damn it. When I can parry, I should try to do so. Right now, though, it's not looking good. Like that. Oh, what? I thought I parried it. Oh, if you, if you accidentally go in for a parry when you should dodge, it really punishes you for that. It doesn't let you then dodge. Maybe this isn't the best guy to be practicing uh, my parries against. I've used to pull my stamina. Oh, better not do damage to me. No, it's not going to. That's okay. I don't suppose any of the dead men in this pit have uh, rations on them. Oh, can we do a two on one? I I'd like some help. No? Okay, the assassin dude's just useless. He tried to steal my honor and then still failed. Oh, he's throwing things. I almost got me. I was hoping I could... Oh, crap. Please let me pick up the ration. There we go. Heals. Heals all around. There we go. Cool. So the game isn't completely... Uh... Oh, where'd that come from? Where did he pull that axe out of? Oh, there we go. Yes, look at the damage! Get a, a cheeky... Oh no, I don't quite have a full adrenaline yet. Oh, there we go. Down you go, boy. Oh, that's what I thought. That was closer than I would have liked it to have been. <laughs> thought it was going to be easier. I nearly lost. I 
place that our war was kissed. The harvest of three dead generations, all their names are known. It all means nothing. No. My plan will not be forgotten! Damn, he just put a tree as through that guy. As, did, as hard as I did to survive, for I know what awaits us in the end. Holy darkness. <laughs> oh, damn. A bit grim, isn't it? I mean, that's Norse, Norse mythology for you. They're doing, they're doing tr true to it there. Everyone knows trees just Your grow up through people. Forfeit. Come forward if you must. Into the crucible of your doom. Your father is dead, Gorim. His debt repaid. Open the gates and you will be spared. Wallow in shit, wolf kissed. Archers, take aim. Ravens, show no mercy. Archers, fire. Hey, we got the helmet. Can I equip it? There we go. And now we get a an additional increase to critical chance. Good. Oh, it's hiding the helmet, though. Do we want I mean, we're in a battle right now. I'm going to show the helmet. There we go. Ah, I'm being shot. Run away. The lock is destructible from inside. Okay, so I'm supposed to climb a ladder, I presume. Am I allowed up the ladder? Out the way, bitches. I'm going up this ladder. I'm going to get pushed off, aren't I? Oh, there's a lot of them up here. Can I get some friends up here? Oh, they threw their shields away. I don't quite understand the thinking, but sure. Oh, these guys feel like chumps compared to the big Chad we just killed. Go on, hit me, I dare you. Oh, you just touched my shield, now you're dead. Can I just assassinate this guy from behind? No, but I do extra damage hitting from behind, so I'll take advantage of that. I get to where's the gate? Here it is. Let's let in all of our friends, shall we? Come on, men, charge into the gate. Follow me. Don't even need my axe and my shield, I just put them away. I'll beat everyone up with my fists. Now the real question is, is unarmed a viable form of combat in this? Can I be... Oh, hello. That guy can't block arrows with his axe. Well, he can throw things though. He's got a sling. Put your sling away. Okay, that's definitely supposed to be a group ability. When I used it on the boss, that was pointless. Oh, he ducked. What a bastard. Who said you're allowed to duck? Yeah, get him, Dag. Fall to my arrow. How am I supposed to get in here then, eh? We go around this way? Looks like a viable entrance. That was not a viable entrance. Come, blood bag. Okay, 
Okay, sneaky time. They don't know we're here. I'll do. I was trying to go across the across the thing, but it didn't want to let me. Okay, I can't just uh, assassinate them from behind. That's a shame. Cool. Get your shield up. I don't think this is the way you're supposed to do this, but it's working. Probably better if I just come down here, right? <laughs> That's alright, try and shoot me. I bet you can't hit me while I'm in an animation. Oh, you can. Okay, run away. Come on, everyone. In you go. Maybe they're going to come out? You guys aren't doing a very good job of stopping people, if I'm honest. I need to practice my blooming parrying. Come on. Okay, look, parries also do use stamina, so that's something to keep in mind. Come on everyone, it's time to take all their riches. Out the way, you. I'm here for the treasure. Ooh, a new weapon. Uh, letter from Gotham the Wise. I'm Gotham, you, you know who I am. Some call me the Hunter. I speak with the full authority of my nephew, King Harold. Who has had an interest in a strong and united Norway, and I would speak with you on this. I invite you to my own great hall, or I can come to you if that is more to your liking. Okay, so the uh, King Harold's uncle was here as well, which basically means we're going to be betrayed, which is what I initially suspected. We can probably pick up all of the. We can probably pick up all of the wealth around here after we've done this. Blind pursuit of vengeance. Has made you predictable. You are a shadow of your father, Gorm. Weak and witless. And you will leave this place as ashes on the wind. Oh, hello. That's not good. Let's get moving. I believe he went this way. And he's off. Good God, please. His father dies twice today. Hey, boy. We have the day. Let the coward go. Now, are you... You don't look so well, mate. The lighting is not doing anything for your complexion right now. Um, I'm interested to know, is it going to teleport me elsewhere when I speak to you? I kind of want to speak to you, but I also want to go and collect all the wealth in the area. The breath of battle rises from my brow. The skulls will sing of this night. We have won the day, but Gorm escaped. He's led north to King Harald's domain. Let that bruised piglet run where he may. His father is dead. His clan is no more. We are the masters of Ruya Vilke. A toothless cup may grow to be a dangerous wolf. Eivor, stop. And listen. You have reclaimed your honor. Enjoy the night's victory. Tomorrow, we will celebrate. You're right, brother. You're always right. King Harold of Norway. That rings a bell, doesn't it? Remain use of our victory to your nephew, CK3. I have done so already, Sigurd. You'll be more than pleased. 
and will ensure you pride of place at his Aldhing at Aldhingstad. Tell him we will come. Battle first and singing songs of glory. Keep company with kings, and you will soon have a crown of your own. <laughs> if the fates have spun it so, linger here and loot what you can. I will bring news of our victory. Yes, to loot. Father That's what I've been waiting for you to say. Alving. I know, Sunan. Another time. Okay, apparently I have to sleep there first. I was thinking looting first, but apparently no. Hey guys, um, I, I think you might have an issue. Guys? Okay. Leave you to it. Now, if the pop-ups are... Oh no, the pop-ups hadn't done. I was going to say, if the pop-ups are done, we'll go and hide this. Because it looks better. And now we need to have a look what is in the area. So I got that one bit. Looks like there's some more wealth over there. We should go and grab that. And then there's other bits further down the fortress. Okay, we have full rations. That's good. Now, where is this? Is it behind the waterfall? Come on, you can get up there. Alexios could have got up there. You can do it too. We definitely want to get the higher one first, because once we've gone up, we can come back down more easily. Bill says it's higher. Ah, in here, probably. Here we go. Some candles here. We found the secret den. Oh. Area not available. Okay. I guess I'll come back later, then. That's disappointing. Ooh, I thought he was gonna hit the ledge then. That wouldn't have been good. Okay, don't go in cold water. Bad idea. Um, yeah, so there's more wealth just if we go through the fortress. So we want to go and grab that. How will we ever be the mighty king of England if we don't even have a fortress worth of wealth? Oh, that hurt. <laughs> I'm glad that didn't do too much damage. It's hard to tell what I can and sh what I should and shouldn't jump off. Apparently we have some wealth in here. You're not going to let me in, are you? Doesn't look like it's going to be an entrance in the roof. Just set the thing on fire. Going that way. I smash this window. Well, it's made of twigs. Let me smash the window. Can I get up? Don't know. This way. There we go. Now, there's no entrance on the roof. How do I get in here? I don't need to do a heavy attack, do I? No, that's clearly not doing anything. Candle, I can see in that window. Definitely in here, isn't it? Yeah. Ooh, 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 ooh. I remember watching a YouTube video. 
And I believe, this is before the game came out, I believe they did something akin to this. There we go. So apparently I can't just smash that with my axe. You can only penetrate wooden windows using arrows. Wood defeats wood. Carboninga, nice, now we can upgrade something. Can I get out of here now? No. Now, what else are we looking at while we're here? A little yellow dot there. Am I supposed to find it with Birdo friend? There. Now, does that count as one of the, like, bits of wealth in the area? I would assume not, and we'll go get it to check. This is probably just going to be some minor thing, like, um, a bit of coin or something. If so, these are probably just things we want to grab in passing. Yeah, little chest. These are probably things we want to try and grab in passing as opposed to aiming for to collect. That in mind, is there anything else? There's another little chest over there, we could grab that. And then there is a mystery down here which we should get while we're in the area. Whereabouts is this little bit of resource? That's what these are. They're just little resources like leather and iron. Things that we'll probably collect a lot of through the game, but it's definitely not a bad thing to collect some early on. Save us time later if we can get things like that in passing. And then we have a mystery down here. I assume it's a mystery. It's not, it couldn't be an artifact, surely. Because I saw. Weren't the mysteries blue? Would that be a mystery? Which then begs the question what is this? Obviously, I'm looking at the mini map. Not the mini map, but the compass at the top while saying all of this. Ah. It's a map. Okay. Oh, there was an artifact. Was the map the artifact? So then how do I make use of the map? Oh yeah, we also picked up this. It's got more attack, more stun, slightly more weight. Speed is lower. I'm going to play with this for a bit. Cool, yeah, we'll play with that. Play also cool. Um, actually, though, we need to look at the map, don't we? Map's probably in here, so we picked up some runes, a collectible, Order of the Ancients Medallion, I don't know when I actually picked that up, and treasure map. Hunters of Silver Glory, east of Alrexstead, the Horde will look upon you from the Targhattan Rock's Eye. Engage its gaze and reap this reward. So is that where we are right now? I assume it probably is. No. Don't know where that place is. These are probably things we want to do later. It'd be nice if there was a fast travel point around here. That one up there is quite far away. I'm supposed to head all the way up there. We have a long way to go. I guess I'm supposed to take a horse north. I guess we'll go do that. In fact, we might as well get the horse through the settlement.
Uh, we're probably supposed to go this way. Just trying to predict what the game actually wants us to do at each point. Just to make it so the whole series can be a bit smoother so I don't backtrack too much and things like that. Can I tell it to follow the road? It doesn't seem to want to follow the road. Ah, on a watchtower, and it has some wealth for us. Who owns this here watchtower? It appears to be my enemies. Let us say hello. Not a restricted area. It's that there's some dickheads here that need removing. <laughs> what a gunshot. True. Can I get in this tower? Is anyone going to see me? I come around here? Oh, that guy will. I don't do this first. Goodbye. <laughs> Damn it. There's windows though. <laughs> Parkour in Assassin's Creed games I always feels slightly different between them. I'm just getting used to controlling it is a bit weird. When it's very it's very similar but just slightly different, which makes you just make slight mistakes all the time. We need. I'm gonna go out this way now. Apparently, that is not the way to open a barred door. Why can't I just open it? Eivor, surely. Well, that's your guy outside. We perhaps don't want to just open it. Am I supposed to shoot it? Do you always have to shoot them? Is that it? Too late. Goodbye. Uh, there's two more guys over there, but we don't need to do anything with them. I think all we needed was that wealth from here. And now we can continue on our way. Oh, this area we're going to has a suggested power of 280. We're not quite there yet, so I probably want to play nice while we're there. Give me a horse. Give me a good boy. Let's go. Wolves or snow foxes. I think there's actually foxes. Now we enjoy the cinematic view. I don't know how, I can't remember how you turn on the cinematic, so I have to check some of the controls and stuff between episodes. Now we'll definitely be coming back to this area later due to the incredibly high difficulty of this area. So I don't think I need to necessarily make sure I pick things up now. Except seeing as we're about to go right past this, I might as well do it. Alright, children. What is all this? Who bangs the drums of war? Look at you! A battle-hardened vikinger! <laughs> Just what we need! Oh, and what do you need this battle-hardened warrior for? One day, we will be the greatest warriors beneath our banner! Skulls will write songs off the wolf pack, but we must first practice our raiding! <laughs> Going on a raid? Then we shall raid! Three wolves and I will be forced to your lead! 
Wolf pack! They ran. Four warriors, like four limbs of one clawing body. Each limb built to kill. Destroy. Is there something else I was supposed to do here? Or was I supposed to follow those children? A couple of the children ran away. The child is following me now. The other two went over here, it looks like. They arrived at the village. Torches, axes, and blades set the red. Well, they've actually got all Ready things set up. Slaughter. To war! So this episode is now called Playing with Children. Um, is there anything else I'm supposed to do here? Well, there's a guy up there. I'm, I assume I'm supposed to kill all these things. There we go. I defeated all the bad guys, kids. What do you want me to do now? I feel like it's supposed to be obvious what you do here, but... I'm missing something. Boy, kid, what do you want? While we're here, I can try breaking these things. Oh, there we go. Ah, chest, nice. Beauty is loot. Pack silver is stuffed into the big wolf's purse. Together, the wolf pack stands in the wreckage of the enemy village. Nothing remains but frost to be taken and flaming carnage. Come and kneel before your raid leader, big wolf. Uh, <laughs> Ah, uh, a successful raid. Yes. With your help, we slaughtered the Raven Clan for good. Oh, shit. Raven Clan, you say? Yes. Just like Chot Vial's stories. One day, I'll be just like him. Oh, so he was, um... He was under the guy we just killed. Countless young raiders. I'll see you wolves on another battlefield one day. Nah, probably not. I do like these little mysteries though. Just to uh, take out some of the monotony of travelling from place to place. And we are where we need to go now. So that will be all for today. At the in the next episode we will go in and see the king again and he's probably going to betray us because let's be fair that's pretty much the only thing that can occur here I mean just look at the power structure if I go to the map we are a power level one he is a power level 280 and if anyone knows anything about power scaling and that means uh, we're screwed for now and we have to come back later after having been through um, a couple of training montages and things like that until then, though, I hope you have a very nice day, and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.